I need to get my shit together. <laughs> All right, let's do this. Hey guys, what's up? It's Catherine. Welcome to today's video. I'm in my brand new office in our brand new house. So say hello to the new filming background slash setup. Um, painted the office. It's a beautiful shade from Bayer. I think it's called Creamy Mushroom. No, Gravel Stone just in case anybody was wondering. Um, so yes, we have this beautiful setup for my background. We're still working on getting um, something to go here and something to go there. So the background will be a little more full eventually, um, but this is the starting point. We just moved in two weeks ago. We're still getting settled. But I feel like we're pretty settled for just moving in two weeks ago. I feel like we're doing pretty solid. If you guys are curious to see, there's little flies in here, not that. Um, if you guys are curious to see a house tour, I have uh, quite a few of them up on my channel, just in my vlogs and stuff. Um, just look for the ones that say house tour in the title and you will find them. All right, let's hop into today's video. As you can tell by the title, I'm gonna be doing a January favorites slash current favorites now that it is already February, which is crazy. I feel like January took forever to move along um i'm also pretty sick right now so i cannot hear out of this side of my like this this ear i cannot hear out of so i really don't know what the sound sounds like i feel like i sound pretty stuffy so i apologize for that i normally do not sound this way we're working through it needed to get a video up today and i have quite a few that i need to film so i just realized you can see me in the mirror in the background i hope that's not too distracting to anybody <laughs> all right let's just hop in I've got quite a few favorites that I want to talk to you guys about first one being this brand new camera if you guys watch my vlogs I talked about it this is the Canon M50 um, just with the kit lens I love it I have my old Rode microphone which I actually have had since I very first started YouTube did that sentence even make sense uh, no some of my words are not gonna make sense today and I apologize I'm just very sick and tired and yeah. <laughs> so, okay, very first item. I have them all literally hanging out of my desk. Let's just start with this one right here. So this is basically my new makeup storage. I got this from the container store. It's just one of their little stacker, um, stackers, boxes, jewelry holders, <laughs> whatever you would like to call it. Um, so when you open it up, it basically just holds all of your jewelry. The, the, words it holds all of your jewelry really nicely I love it um, I think this was around 30 ish dollars so it's definitely a little pricey for jewelry storage but I only have a minimal amount of jewelry right now if I um, end up getting more jewelry I'll probably buy the other pieces that's kind of what I love about it is you can buy um, other boxes to stack with it so it'll be like a really nice little tier jewelry stand um, storage so they have lots of different options. This is just the box that I chose. I throw my long necklaces back here, and then some of my other necklaces and my bracelets, but I'm wearing most of my stuff right now, and then we have all of my rings and earrings and stuff just hanging out. So, love this. Mine is um, like the faux leather one, I believe. I don't know, it's like the nicer than just like the velvet boxes. Um, once I get the rest of the office set up, this will be on display somewhere once I get everything figured out. But I love it. It's really awesome. And um, I don't know. I've heard that if you like leave your jewelry out in the open in the air, it can tarnish quicker. So I just figured it's better overall long term for my jewelry. Next item that we have on here. I have mentioned this on my channel before, but I wanted to mention it again because you guys, I found this for $18 at tj maxx and this is the beaker water bottle i love this i have another one it literally looks just like this this one has the little like rx logo on it um i don't know if it was like part of their warehouse sale and they needed to get rid of extras or something but i randomly found it at tj maxx it was only 18 bucks and i was like wow i paid 50 dollars for my other one from the beaker website so just a little heads up you can now find beaker stuff at tj maxx i thought that was awesome it was either tj maxx or home goods one of those stores but i love this. this is the one liter size i find that i drink a lot more water from this and then i do with my hydro flask i haven't really been using my hydro flask i also really like that you can throw this in the fridge because i'm someone that likes chilled water so i love that i can throw this in the fridge and like chill it versus with the hydro flask the water already had to be chilled and sometimes 
that just doesn't always work out. So, love that. Um, I use my other one a ton. This whole like only being able to hear out of one ear thing is throwing me way off today. I apologize, guys. All right. Uh, next up, I'm going to talk about some phone cases. Um, I ordered a few different phone cases from different companies. So this first one that we have is this one from Case Defy. You guys can see my little setup on my desk here. Um, this one is their mirror case. I just put Exo Catherine on it. It was around 50-ish dollars. Kind of expensive for a phone case, I'm not gonna lie. It is very protective, I do really like it, um, but I am someone that likes to switch my phone cases pretty frequently, so the whole price point on this one was a little high for me to wanna order another one, and I also talked about like a little issue that I had with customer service and that whole thing. Um, I talked about that in another vlog, so if you guys watch the vlogs, you know what happened with that, but I do really like the case. Um, and then I also, ordered a few cases from Berga. I absolutely love them. I have been ordering cases from them and working with them since probably like 2016, 2017, somewhere around there. Um, I have, they have sent me multiple cases. I've also purchased multiple cases um, from them on my own. Um, I just, I really love their cases and they're a really good price point. So these ones are the two that I ordered recently. This is like their pistachio case. It's like a marble pistachio color. I love it. Um, I just get the plastic snap on ones. They're around like $23 and they do have like protective ones that um, are basically like the snap on plus like a nice um, solid protection like the silicone protection that goes around your whole phone um, those ones I think are around like $30 so honestly pr price point wise they're really affordable the only thing with the phone cases is I will say sometimes they take anywhere from 10 to 20 days to ship so if you're looking for a phone case like immediately I mean I wouldn't say order from them um, but if you don't mind waiting for a phone case honestly I don't mind because I love the cases so much the, the only downside is obviously the shipping time frame kind of takes a while but this is the other one um oh gosh i'm like kind of dying because my throat hurts but we're gonna make it through this video guys i still have multiple videos to film today but love this phone case this is just another plastic one it kind of looks like snake skin leather ish i really like it um so those are the two that i have ordered i also ordered other ones um another time but i showed those in another favorites video or something but I really truly do love Berga I love their phone cases they are plastic though so if you drop your phone a lot I would definitely suggest getting like the more protective ones versus just the snap-on cases just a heads up with that all right let's move on into some other stuff so another thing that I have in here are some blue light glasses um, I just recently worked with iBuyDirect which was like a dream come true um, so if you guys watched that vlog you already saw these glasses but I am in love with these. I love these so much that I actually ordered, because these ones are just actual blue light glasses because I usually wear my contacts quite a bit. So I ordered these exact ones in um, like my prescription plus the blue light. So when I'm not wearing my contacts, I can wear these. But I love these so freaking much. They're so cute. All of their stuff is so affordable too. Um, so these ones are the Ana ones and I love the pattern on this. I'm obsessed. I've pretty much purchased all of my eyeglasses from iBuyDirect. Um, this was the first time they've ever sent me anything and that was literally a dream come true. I love their stuff so much. Um, and then these are the other fun blue light ones that I've been loving. These ones are the St. Michelle. So both very cute. Love these if you guys just want some blue light glasses. They're pretty affordable and they come in cute cases if you order like from the Reflect. Um, one, I think that's when you get like this nice case and then other ones come in like a cute little cleaning cloth slash case. So love, love, love those. Um, and then moving on, we pretty much have some like skincare and beauty stuff left. So first thing I want to talk about is the Laneige Lip Sleeping Mask. I feel like I'm so late to the game. Everybody has been talking about this and I just now hopped on the train for this. And now I see why everybody loves it. Um, I've had this for like probably a month, two months now, and I still have so much left and I use this every single night before I go to bed. Um, this is one, since you have to use your finger to put it on, I don't really like bringing it out with me like in my purse or my car or anything because sometimes like my hands aren't always clean and 
you know, you do like your skincare routine and stuff right before bed so your hands are clean and then I just like use this and put this on. So that has been my favorite go-to. They also have a vanilla one that sounds very intriguing, but obviously I have so much left in this, I can't bring myself to buy a second one just to try it out when I have so much in here. But honestly, this thing is 20 bucks and this is so, so much product. Highly, highly recommend if you guys have not checked it out already. Now I see why everybody is raving about it. My throat is getting so dry from talking so much. This is the most talking that I've done in a few days because Monday I spent the entire day in bed trying to get rid of this cold, whatever this is. All right, next up in here, we have some deodorant. I talked about buying this probably a month or two ago in one of my vlogs, and now I wanna update you guys that this is the Myro plant-based deodorant. I really, really enjoy this. Um, I am a huge native fan as well. Their stuff is great, but sometimes I find it melting off me, if you will, like dripping. I don't know if that is just me, but sometimes at the gym I have that issue when I'm sweating and it's just, you know, melting down the sides if you're not wearing a sweatshirt. Um, and also sometimes I feel like Native doesn't totally last as long, but I think I like this one almost a little bit better than Native. And this one is also refillable. I have not used enough of it to have to do the refill, um, but somehow you can like refill these. I swear it's like with little pods like the bottom comes out and you can just buy like a replacement thing i'm pretty sure that's the whole deal with these but really really enjoy this this one i don't remember what what flavor what scent this is in like i can really smell with my nose so stuffed up right now <laughs> um but the green one i really really like it. it smells really good i feel like it lasts a while and i don't find myself like stinking early on in the day so i really like that one and you can also find it at target too um, next up, I want to talk about some skincare stuff. So this is the BioClarity Cleanse, their cleanser. I love it. I feel like I'm the last person on the earth to try out BioClarity stuff. And now I see there's just a little flies in here. Um, they're from my little baby plant back there somewhere. I don't know if you can see them. Um, I really like it. It's really cleansing. Um, I'm doing like a little six week challenge with them right now. And I've been using it way longer than six weeks. I started using it well in December when they sent it to me before it was like the challenge started on Instagram. So if you guys are curious how that's been going, um, that is all on Instagram um, if you guys want to follow along with that. But I really, really do love their products. Um, I definitely see myself ordering more of this in the future. Um, so that is that. And then we've got some, let's talk about self-tan stuff really quick. Um, so. Recently, I have hopped on the Loving Tan train as well. I am allergic to their foaming tan, so I never really was interested in trying it because I thought I was allergic to everything that they did. Um, but then I found out that there's nothing that I'm allergic to in their gradual tan, so this is what I've been using. It's literally out. I finished it off last night, so I'm going to need to get some more. This is their um, gradual tan in dark, and then I also have their face gradual tan in dark as well. This one is amazing. I didn't get a chance to use it last night because I did get my lashes done yesterday, so I haven't been able to wash my face and like do anything for at least 24 hours after. So after I do this video and film for the day, then I'm gonna wash my face and probably put some more tan on. But I absolutely love this stuff and now I see my so many people enjoy it thoroughly. Other thing I wanna talk about is some hair care stuff. So this is by Unite. This is just their leave-in conditioner. It's their seven second detangler. I love this stuff. I, you guys, I cannot believe how long my hair has gotten. It's so freaking long. I rarely put heat on my hair, so that is like the biggest thing for me and why my hair grows so quickly. I also really need to get it done. I'm looking at my roots in the camera and wow, they are grown out. So, love this stuff. This is the leave-in conditioner that I will use after I wash my hair. I usually only wash my hair twice a week. Um, if you guys are curious in like a hair care routine, let me know and I can give you the whole rundown on that and all the products that I use. Um, and then another one of my favorites has been the Living Proof Dry Shampoo. I swear this used to be like $30, but I've been finding it at Target for only $14. And I love this stuff so much. It's so good. Um, I just, I don't know. Every time I use it, I love it. It smells good. It really just like soaks up all the oil. My hair doesn't get like super crunchy or gross. So that's been a huge favorite of mine. All right, that is basically it for all of my favorites. I will go ahead and try to link everything down below for you guys if you guys want to check any of it out. Wow, look at that self-tan on my hands. I did not do a good job last night. 
Um, so yeah, hope you guys enjoyed it. Comment down below one of your favorites from this past month um, or maybe something that you think I should check out. I'd love to see your guys' recommendations. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll catch you guys in my next video.